Good morning. Do you have a camera? I do. What is the camera for? Um, we just had a gentleman who just pushed me, shoved me, tried to push me out in the street. So I have a camera on for those kind of things. The police had to come, and that way there's video evidence if I've been assaulted or any of our people have been and, assaulted. And do you videotape the people as they come in? We Well, that's on video, sure. Absolutely. What's the purpose of that? I just told you the purpose of the camera. Uh, the reason I wear the camera is exactly what happened this morning. I was just assaulted by a man, and hmm. we need to have video evidence in case. I saw a video of somebody screaming crazy stuff, somebody who was wearing a camera. Who was what do you mean by crazy stuff, ma'am? Painful, attacking. What, like what kind of thing was he screaming? Well, uh, I'm sorry, I didn't memorize it. Well, yeah, so harassing people who are coming into this clinic. Yeah, so being telling them the truth is not harassing them. You don't know anything about the truth about being a woman or how to take care of how women need to take care of their bodies. No, but I know about babies being murdered, and that's against care God, about the law of God. Women's lives. I care about babies' lives come as well. Come to this clinic and seek health care. Shame and on you and, and, and your And take the life of ha half the women that get half the babies that get killed are women. Half the babies that are murdered are women, ma'am. I care about them as well. They're not babies. What are they? You were an embryo at one time, ma'am. What was the difference between what's the difference between you now and you as an embryo? Now I'm interested in what you do for babies once what's, they're born. We'll, we'll adopt do them. You, we'll oh, adopt how them. How many adopted kids? Uh, do we you have know? seven in our church. I have one personally. So we'll adopt them, and we tell every one of these ladies we'd love to adopt their baby. So now, I, I, that's my answer. My question to you is: When you were an embryo, what's the difference between you now and then? Consciousness, having a soul. So, so you didn't have a soul when you were an embryo? No. When did you get your soul? I don't know. It's a mystery. Well, it's well, what you, but you obviously know you there, didn't have. There's some mystery. But ma'am, you. That I am comfortable. But ma'am, you just you just claim that we, you didn't have one as an embryo, so that means you must know when you got one, because <laughs> scripture would teach you have a soul from the time you're conceived. But ma'am, you're begging the question. You're not answering that question because you don't have an answer don't to that. I have to answer to you. No, ma'am, you don't. But you're woman, talking to me. I have received gynecological care. Yep. I have been in need. I, I hope. Well, I hope you haven't had an abortion. No, no I have not. Praise not God. That it's any of your business. Well, it, it, it's it, none of your business. It is because I care about your soul. No. Well, my soul doesn't need it. It does need it. All of our souls well, needs it. Dare you harass these women? No, I'm not, ma'am. I'm not harassing anyone. The I would say. Presence harasses. I would say. Women. I would say Your that if. if Space feel because they're because their consciences an unsafe place for women to because their consciences are pricked to kill babies that's what they come to do you are kill babies <laughs> ma'am you won't say you it but that's what's sick. happening shame on ma'am you. you're sick shame on you you will answer for the murderous heart that you have ma'am